All right, well, I've got the uh, bobbin motor rearranged here, and I've got the uh, little uh, bobbin mounted on a adjustable shaft above the rotating magnet. And I'm running this off a pure, simple reed switch arrangement. And the reed switch is triggered by the rotating magnet there, which turns the electromagnet on, and I'm running it off of uh, a AA battery with a little rheostat to control things. And I can also use this uh, little bobbin motor um, um, solid state circuit with that. It'll actually be compatible and work together. But what I wanted to show today was Maggie. And that's Maggie with her eyes on. And she's got a little rotating ball, a uh, neodymium sphere ball in her mouth. I call it her magic pill, energy pill. And she's actually on right now with her eyes lit up at quite a ways away from that rotating magnet. And this is a wireless transmission of energy through a rotating flux field. And uh, what I wanted to show today was how this worked. I showed this one other time, but uh, I thought this would be a good time to show it again. This will work right through water. This will work through plant matter and it'll also work through um, something like a book so like you have this uh, mounted on the other side of a wall someplace you could actually transmit the energy right through a wall if there was no ferrous material in the wall <clears throat> and I had another video before it called flux field generator using Maggie and my thought was you could have one of these generators on the other side of a wall and generate electricity into another room through the wall if you didn't have any ferrous material in it and I thought this would be a good time to show that phenomena was uh, uh, this uh, transmission of energy through a rotating flux field now I'll listen you can listen to what it sounds like here there's the, the uh, pulse motor going, and there's Maggie's eyes on. <clears throat> I'm going to rev this up using this little uh, auxiliary pulse motor here. You can hear this rev up. Maggie's eyes are going to get a lot brighter here. And they just went off. Now, when that RPM gets to a certain point, that ball can't keep up with it and turns off. And you can see her eyes are off right now. Now, I'm going to take this away and slow this thing down again. I'm going to use Maggie to do it. There goes her eyes. Bring her back out here. See her eyes go off? That speed has to be just right for that ball to spin up in her mouth and stay spinning. <clears throat> Take the ball out here. There's a little ball right there. And you can see her eyes don't work until she gets real close to that spinning, spinning magnet, unless there's that ball in her mouth. Go out and come on. But if I put this ball back in her mouth, and I get that ball rotating, then I can use her at a distance. And I just thought that was very interesting. This rotating uh, flux field energy um, with a uh, rotating neodymium magnet and that transmission of energy wirelessly through a rotating flux field. Anyway, that was my demonstration for today. The latest with a little bobbin pulse motor and Maggie. Thanks for watching.